morning guys and welcome back to my channel today i have a few things to do so i decided to take you along with me i have to go outside twice and before to say why don't you just go once and do everything together i don't want to first of all i decided what to get my mom for the march and it's a gift card she will choose what to do with it i just said the amount and i said 150 dollars maybe it's too much but I saw from the website where I get it that for if you set this limit, like you can get more offers than for a hundred. And there is also a good thing if it's not enough, she can pay the rest. Or if it's too much for the activity, she can split. For example, you pick something for fifty dollars, she can use the rest hundred dollars for something else. Well, for the validation of this gift card, because you have one year. Otherwise, well, on their website, say that you can extend it for three months but you have to pay 20 percent of the initial value and i'm not willing to do that so hopefully she will do it later i have to go and pick up some uh candy we saw on discount hopefully there are still some left in the store but there are two kilos of candies for like 16 bucks which is an offer because usually one kilo is like 12 to 13 dollars and like that one is eight dollars which is kind of still over there i would love candy and I'll see if we'll go pick up something else then. My mom wanted me to go out with her to look for some 8 of March presents from my grandma's. So I don't know exactly if we're gonna find something, what will happen. But let's just say that we still have some things to do. I'm gonna go get ready, do all the things that I have to do before I go out. And I'm gonna see you then. Peace. Here's a little skincare. I do the same. I put the cream this time on my hand because the other one finished. And I have to go all the way to the bathroom, so uh, this is what we have today. Maybe about too much. But anyways, to fulfill you about today, like, it started raining last night, and I'm afraid that it might rain today as well. That's definitely a lot. And this means I won't be able to go out or something that I do don't want to happen. I definitely put too much, so I'm gonna rub this one around my hands. But I don't like carrying umbrellas. Like, yes, I'm from these people. And I have such a bad experience with umbrellas umbrellas mostly because i don't carry them like this carry them kind of the back like the chinese people do with their umbrellas and i always find my hair like stuck on there and i don't like it so me and umbrellas don't understand each other that well our relationship i would say it's complicated but this doesn't mean that well if it's raining heavily i won't even at this point just go out but uh, I have some things to do. And 8th of March is tomorrow, technically. So basically, when you see this video, already be 8th of March. I'm not gonna post reaction to videos and stuff like this. It's way too much. But uh, yeah, let's just say that I don't have much time. And I don't have... I can go tomorrow, technically, because my mom will be already at work by the time when I wake up. So uh, that's a thing. I have to spread this out evenly, but... I will just do it today, so I will come back at you when I get done with this. Now this looks better, so I have still leftovers from this cream, even though I bought it like a month ago. But I kind of did it as a routine to put this thing, like in the morning and in the evening. So, um, oh, until I finish, will I buy another one? Honestly, I'm not sure if there is any effect, like it tends to prevent dark circles and stuff like this. I don't see like that many dark circles it's just because i woke up now it looks like this but throughout the day this thing disappears so i feel like it's normal when you wake up your eyes to look like that because you still let's say didn't got fresh throughout the day but it is a good one definitely it's kind of refreshing my face so i don't know i might give it a shot with another one or try the other one which was with cherry or something i don't know what's the difference except for the fact that there is the price difference and this one is with mint, aloe vera, coffee, and vitamin C. That's the only thing I can read from this. Because I have no idea what language it is. But yeah, this is a little skincare routine. Now, I'm going to finish the current chapter as usual. But I just wanted to tell you that because I found it crazy when I found out. So basically, I managed to free 50 gigabytes of storage on my laptop from disk C. I have been dealing for months with this, more than half. And I was like... Okay, how the heck am I supposed to do that? Like, something is in my storage and I had no idea what it was. And when I found out, I literally couldn't believe it. So basically, I expected every single folder to find out where it's coming from. And apparently, from my editor, 
the one that I'm using to edit my videos, in one of its folders, it's keeping like a copy of every single video that I have made for the past couple of months. Like even the short clips that I download from the cloud to my laptop, like it's keeping this for, I don't even know what reasons. And it created more than 50 gigabytes. And I was like, how the heck, like, how is it possible? I never thought that this actually was a thing that, cause I delete everything in the trash bin. Like, I don't know why I kept it there, but when I thought I was like, you gotta be kidding me. I deleted everything and I'm so happy because I was like, I'm switching this laptop. I need more storage and stuff like this. But now technically I don't need to do that. Well, in the future I might still do it, but just check your folders, inspect everything because you never know like where, what you're looking for is hiding. So I'm so happy that I have more storage now because literally I was left on like from 136 gigabytes to like, less than 500 megabytes and this was a disaster but now since i found out i feel so happy that i can download again whatever i want and not worry about the storage and from now on i will keep checking this folder to make sure that there are no copies or somehow i need to change my settings but i'm glad that i resolved this issue i finished all my tasks that i had until lunch currently this is what i'm doing i decided to grab something before i go out so as i'm checking the weather it is still foggy though not gonna deny that, but hopefully it's not gonna rain because I don't want to bring an umbrella with me. And also, I will try to be quick because, that's all I said, it's another Formula World Weekend. I'm so excited. Like, usually it's Friday, Saturday, Sunday, but they have moved the first two races to be Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. We are in Jeddah! I don't know if I'm, I'm excited because F1 is back, but I'm not excited because I expect Verstappen to win again and I'm not glad about it because no offense, but can someone defeat this dude already? Like, hello? I mean, I want to watch an interesting championship, not like Max Verstappen winning every single race 20 plus seconds ahead of the second person. I'm like, dude, like, just bring some interest. I already stopped looking for who will finish first. I get excited who will finish second and who will complete the podium. Before, I was excited because, yes, there was domination again of the Mercedes, but it wasn't as much as it is of, like, Red Bull now, and more specifically Max Verstappen. But anyways, comment down below if you want me to sit and talk about Formula 1 and all these obsessions that I have. And if there are any F1 fans here, comment down below because I just want to chat with people who actually want to listen about it, not just me sitting and bragging. So I would love to hear what are your comments about this topic. So I'm currently outside. The echo here is so weird. Okay, I'm gonna move a little bit currently outside. I don't know if it's actually raining, it's like dripping. Yeah, we have a a phrase to call it this way, but I'm not gonna say it anyways. It's just so weird the weather. I didn't brought an umbrella in the end. Because it's just I don't wanna carry it. And I already said how I feel about umbrellas. I'm not gonna repeat myself, but first I will go to pick up the gift card before they close. Later, I will go to see the candies and everything else that I have from the food store because probably around 5 p.m. Mommy, my mommy will call me to go out again. So it's not that cold, maybe because I'm coming from the warm of the inside. But anyways, going out and I'll see you later. I'm in the second store right now. Technically, it's the first one because I just picked up an order. Anyways, there's so many people here probably because of 8 of March. Yes, I'm in the pasta section. I just needed some pasta because I finished my spaghetti at home. But anyways, I found the candy. Good thing that some of them have left. Now I'm gonna see what else I have to get from here and head out because it's it's just so hot in here. Maybe because there's so many people, but I don't want to spend too much money first. But I'm also this sweet, you know. I'll see if there is anything for me. Then I'll head out and show you what I got. When I go home, it's still slightly rainy. I don't know if it's even supposed to be cold or rain, but anyways, I'm gonna head out. Let's go back to the gray reality. Even though it was hot, it was so nice in the store because it was at least warm and everything, but now it's so clean. That's the plus. Everything else. Um, I don't know what to say, like, probably because it was so hot inside, I'm not cold right now, but definitely we'll get the more I walk. So, free practice almost starting, so probably I'll catch it on the way of my phone, but anyways, I'm gonna watch it, I'm gonna show you what I got from the store, 
not many things I was on a budget then, still managed to hit like $30. I don't know how. And the noise outside. But anyways, I'm gonna go home and show everything that I got. I'm back with everything that I got from the store. I'm gonna, it's getting heavy. But, well, I know what I bought, but still. This is my mom's gift I'm gonna open in a minute. I got these Jaffa cakes. These are extra French diesel with orange. They have only orange and strawberry, and I feel like orange will be better. Well, we kind of ate the sweets at home, so I decided to get these. Uh, yeah, this one kind of ripped off. This is for my grandma. She wanted olives. One bag full of olives. I didn't got for us because, no, well, I didn't want to. And I already spent enough money, so... My wallet is here. How much I paid? The total is... $26.06 and what I got was $23.94 yeah, I got 50 I didn't have less oh my god it's all pasta oh tomorrow I'm gonna eat pasta yes 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 I finished it last week I didn't bought because I technically that's the first time I'm going out this week so uh, yes yes I'm gonna eat my pasta and okay before we get to the big stuff these were on discount again. My precious. Did I got the right one? Yes. For a second I thought, oh no, that's orange. But no, this is apricot. Yes. And because they were on discount, I got another one. One thing, only the apricot and the orange was for $1.09. Everything else was on the regular price for $1.59. It's not a big deal, like 50 cents, but still. And the heaviest things are these two kilogram candy these are can these are the candies that we eat in like grocery these are so delicious this is my baby no i'm sorry call me whatever you want but i just freaking love these these are so good and like if i could eat this i would eat it we're just putting it with my grandma because these are two kilograms like she's getting half we're getting half but they want discount and it's a very good purchase let's check the gift now because here there is something, I don't know if this is candy, what it is, but something is squishy. And I didn't open it at the store because I don't know if there was a check-in, but well, we're going to see right now. Hopefully I won't rip off the bag, but as I see, I, we kind of sometimes re reuse these bags, you know, for trash bags and stuff like this. So uh, I don't know if this will go like, yeah, the, I don't think that, that way will work, but... I might rip off the bag as well. I just shoot and get it open. There we go. It's not the most elegant way, but it is. But oh no, it's open. Okay, I want. There was something in here. They gave me candy for real. Oh my gosh, these are little horror candies. These are so cute. I know I need to. I need to open more open. I will order. So recommend. Here we got the gift. Where is the gift card? Yeah, I didn't put that. Whoa. Okay. This is from the site uh, Gift Come True. I think this is what their website looks like. They offer it in a box. But yeah, giftcometrue.com. So, well, this is it. Sorry, you can use the code, but. Pretty much that's it. It's just a blank card. And uh, it comes in this fancy box still. So props to that. It, it looks very good. They had a box as well. They charge you $5 to put it in this and $8 to put it in a box. Like, and I was like, you know what? Uh, forget it. I don't know if it's supposed to be like this, how I'm supposed to put it in. Okay, let. I think I want to give it to my mom tonight so she can check out the website and eventually, I don't know, she might end up picking something. But I'm going to do it this way. To make her open it. I don't know if this is a technical way, but we got a gift card and two candies. I don't know what they taste like, but I mean, that's a great presentation though for the price that I paid. This is everything that I did today, and basically, that was in my plans. Will I go out later with my mom or not? I don't know. Like, 
we were supposed to go to shop more but checking the weather right now it's not pretty nice he said i don't even know how to describe it because if you call this raining i don't know what the real rain should be called honestly but anyways i think mostly it's because it's foggy not because it's actually raining but anyways despite the weather condition it's not that cold as i expected it to be so maybe we'll go out i'm gonna wait for a call from her but yeah pretty much this is uh everything that i plan to do for today i got i did some groceries and other stuff that i promised to do because you know like some people rely on me you know and okay basically i went for the candy and for the olives mostly because i promised my dad i will go and check if there is still some leftovers people were like animals i see like full shopping carts like they're buying alcohol as if they're gonna feed a whole school or something like i don't know it's just why would you need so much okay i understand you have guests you know eight of march and stuff like this but how many guests do you have and how much do you drink down like literally saw someone with a shopping cart i don't know if there was someone else but i saw at least like five boxes and gosh knows how many alcohol is in each box like maybe because i don't drink alcohol i feel like how much do you drink but uh despite that like yeah some people were buying flowers believe it or not it's a store where you have everything cleaning tools you have food you have flowers you have pretty much whatever you want so it's good to have all in one consider like, like target walmart all this stuff that americans have but well transfer it to another country that will be the end of the vlog i hope you enjoyed please like this video share it with friends subscribe to this channel turn on the bell so you'll be notified whenever i post new videos and I'm going to see you next time. Bye.